If you're wondering where to get drinking water in Alpha 21, then wonder no more because it's not as scarce as you might think. In this quick and to the point video, I'll show you how to stay hydrated in those first tricky couple of days until you can craft your first dew collector. And then I'll show you how to get the parts that you're going to need to build that dew collector, which is gonna give you free drinking water every few in-game hours. Now, the key to the first couple of days hydration is finding a cooking pot and looting all of the murky water that you can find. Murky water can be found everywhere that regular drinks used to be found in earlier alphas, like coffee pots, food piles, water coolers, and of course, toilets. And the best place to find cooking pots is laying around in kitchens or in ovens and cupboards of houses and small restaurant POIs. However, if you're really struggling to find a cooking pot, and it's been a few days and you happen to have crafted a forge by that time, you can easily make a cooking pot in the forge, but I think you're going to be pretty unlucky to go more than two or three days without finding one first. Now once you have your cooking pot, stick it on a campfire and boil all the murky water that you've been looting. It does take a while to boil, but it's got to be done. Now this is where it gets good because phase two of staying hydrated in the apocalypse begins with your first dew collector, which produces a jar of drinking water every few hours in game, totally passively. So once you have a couple of these things set up, you're going to be pretty much set for the rest of the game. And here's the good news again. It's not as difficult to build the dew collector as you might have thought. Yes, there is a rare element that can't be crafted, the water filter, but you can buy them for 1500 dukes from the trader most of the time. The thing that's probably gonna take the longest to gather and get together if you're not thinking about it from day one is the 100 scrap polymers that are required to craft the dew collector. So unlike previous alphas where you're probably not even picking up scrap polymers in the first couple of weeks, in alpha 21, you wanna be saving them from day one and actively looting them as well. Just get out your stone ax and break down things like empty luggage, laundry baskets, computers, more empty luggage, coolers, garbage on the floor, more garbage on the floor, more laundry baskets, brown boxes, and more garbage. And we can see here that I've just gathered 47 scrap polymers just from looting this one house. But with that said, if you happen to be downtown, there's a whole bunch of other places you can gather these scrap polymers, such as these shopping trolleys, these tires at the passing gas, these plastic garbage cans, also these trash piles, these wheelie bins, and these blue barrels. Then once you've gathered your water filter, scrap polymers, and other couple of bits and pieces, you can craft your first dew collector. And as long as you're still grabbing murky water while you're out and about, then you're really not going to be going thirsty. Get a couple of these things set up and you're gonna be pretty much set for the rest of the game. Now there is a lot of other stuff to look out for in your early days of playing Alpha 21. Too much to squeeze into this video. So you can watch this next video to see how to take on your first 48 hours in my new Alpha 21 playthrough series.